despite originally being scheduled for broadcast on BT Sport and being the only midweek Premier League game, Man City's trip to Everton won't be aired on any TV channel in the UK tonight. The game which could see City leapfrog Liverpool to the top of the table by goal difference with a victory was initially going to be played on Saturday, February 23 as the televised 5.30 p.m. kickoff. However, due to City's progression to the Carabao Cup final which is played on February 24 the game was rescheduled and brought forward by 17 days with just 10 days' notice. BT Sport still could have chosen to televise the game, but due to a clash with the BBC who will be broadcasting the FA Cup fourth round replay between West Brom and Brighton, BT Sport have opted to air a different game in the 5.30pm slot on February 23 instead. BT were not allowed to broadcast both Everton vs City and a game at 5.30pm on February 23. Now Leicester City vs Crystal Palace will be televised in its place. Man City vs West Ham was also due to be televised by BT on Tuesday, February 26, but that too had to be rescheduled due to the League Cup final. The game will be played a day later on Wednesday 27, and now a relegation scrap between Newcastle and Burnley will be aired instead on the Tuesday. The Football Supporters Federation have claimed that the fixture changes have left fans of multiple club out of pocket by changing kickoff times for games with just four weeks' notice. BT selected the two city games for broadcast knowing that the Blues would likely make the Carabao Cup final as they faced League One side Burton Albion in the semi and then that would cause the games to be rescheduled, now affecting the fans of clubs who weren't originally included in December's TV release. The original selection of these Manchester City fixtures for broadcast despite knowing that they would almost certainly be moved again suggests that BT Sport really couldn't care less about match-going fans, FSF chief executive Kevin Miles said. Inconveniencing supporters of five other clubs long since knocked out the League Cup raises this disregard to another level. Even with the usual deadlines for notice and guidelines for selection, changes to kickoff times and even dates are already hugely challenging for fans. These conditional TV picks, with their impossibly short notice periods, have a huge impact on an already busy schedule and simply shouldn't be allowed. However, you will be able to follow all the action from Good Ice and Park on our live blog, 